If you're heading to Door County, a project two years in the making is finally complete in downtown Sturgeon Bay. This afternoon, the Michigan Street Bridge reopened. The DOT started renovations on the 80-year-old bridge a couple of years ago, and it's been closed to traffic most of the time since. Fox 11's Christian Crowley tonight explains why people in the area are so happy to see a third way for vehicles to cross the channel. It's not every day you see a party on a bridge let alone a party for a bridge. Today we put balloons by the historic Veterans Memorial plaque on it and um, christened it with some champagne. This group is celebrating the rebirth of the Michigan Street Bridge, a bridge they say is key to Sturgeon Bay. The Michigan Street Bridge is Sturgeon Bay's icon. It's the largest single historic icon that defines this community. The almost 81 year old bridge was in desperate need of rehabilitation, nearly 21 million dollars worth. Good job. This group fought to keep the historic piece of Sturgeon Bay instead of having it replaced by a brand new bridge. And now that it's open for good. We love it and we're glad it'll be around my entire lifetime and hopefully our children's. The celebration of the opening wasn't confined to just the bridge. Just across the canal, there's another group of very happy people. Elated to see it open and hope it's open for a long time. Some say since the bridge has been closed, businesses downtown have suffered. It's a main thoroughfare through the city, so it's a very important corridor. All the fudges are in this case over here. Candy shop owner Terry Ullman has waited patiently for the bridge to open. Even though another bridge is just a few blocks away, he says it's the Michigan Street Bridge drivers head to. I moved my business over here because I want to be one of the first things they see when they come across the bridge. And now business owners and residents say they hope they won't have to celebrate another reopening of the Michigan Street Bridge for a long, long time. In Sturgeon Bay, Kristen Crowley, Fox 11 News. Now, even though the bridge is open, the city says there is still painting on the bridge that needs to be done. That will happen this fall and should be done, the city says, while the bridge stays open.